Hello, or good evening rather. So I'm going to read to you about Encelorado from, oops, this is a photocopy, from Direct Sellers. It is a white wine from Portugal. It is a 2015 blend or wine, and I am not going to fumble through those words. So if you can see what that says, well, that's kind of backwards. But anyway, it's from the Encelorado sunny hillsides of Portugal with bountiful vines flourishing and is surrounded by and sheltered by a bunch of names I can't pronounce. So we're going to skip that. <laughs> um, they are protected from the effects of the Atlantic Ocean and instead has a temperature climate, a temperate climate. The winters are mild with abundant rainfall and the summers are long, warm, and dry. The 2015 vintage was drier than usual, triggering a slightly earlier harvest. These grapes also benefited from the early September rains that nourished, nourished the grapes after the dry season. Granite soil helped to drain the excess water and both quality and quantity were high, particularly in white varietals. Skins were easy to remove from the pulp and lent the grapes to gentler vinification techniques. This 2015 offering is comprised of 35% Bicau, 35% Malvasia Fina, and 30% Encruzado. I think I butchered them, but I tried. Um, the grapes were dis destemmed and underwent a total alcoholic fermentation in stainless steel tanks, lending to the tight, crisp, dry style of this wine. The wine is a pale lemon yellow in color with elegant aromas of white peach and flowers. The palate is bright, showing balanced, lively acidity, notes of pear, honeysuckle, and lemon, and a long finish. As a traditional Portuguese wine, this makes an ideal pairing for traditional Portuguese food, such as salt cod or caldo verde, a stew featuring cabbage, potatoes, onion, and sausage. That sounds interesting. But I probably won't eat that food, but I have tasted the wine, and it is really good. And I like sweet wines, and this is good. I don't have to add uh, some simple sugar or cassis to it. So get yourself some wine from Direct Cellars. See ya.